There's no way to do it. I think there is. You just have to free your mind. Yeah, not surprising from a... Coming from a brilliant theorist like me, yin and yang, love. We're two sides of the same coin. I dream it up, you make it work. And this is no longer our problem anymore, so you can let it go. <laughs> let it go? Yeah. Let it go. Let it go. <laughs> You're too close to this one, detective. Seriously. <sighs> These field theory calculations only make sense in the abstract. Why would the VIPs need an algorithm to visualize at this level? Okay, Mr. Wizard, your turn to make the dishes disappear. Right. First, I got a new one. No, you are not tricking your way out of cleaning again. You're gonna love this one. This is a good one. Okay, you know what, that's fine. You do your thing. I'm gonna stick with this. Science can wait. Time for a little magic. Come on. One trick. Okay. Prepare to have your mind blown. You know, what if we looked at this from a different perspective? You know, drilled way down, pushed the testing frequencies into the millions of cycles per second, looked for collisions. It's okay. <clears throat> I can multitask. Uh, what about background noise? Well, we could develop higher level filtering algorithms, pinpoint the noise, phase it out. Anything left? We'd need time on the holographic interferometer. Yeah. Honey, gonna let me in? Yeah. No, there's... Well, there's something there I hadn't thought about. I mean, we'd still need to model almost the entire system, uh, but if we broke it down into observable structures, looked at CMB... A lot for cutoff. You know, we'd need time on the supercomputer, we'd never be able to... Get through those kinds of transforms. Yeah. We're talking about creating a huge model, I mean, much larger than anything we've tried before. We move into lattice, chromodynamic simulations, ben. push past previous QCD sims. Ben. No, wait, if we're right about this, they're looking for changes in fundamental fields. Ben, the cards. You've been practicing. <gasps> that wasn't part of the trick. Well, there has to be an explanation for this. Assuming you didn't also become a world-class hypnotist or someone didn't lace our dinner. What just happened? Um, something not physically possible? Telekinesis? They're gonna put us away. You know, I didn't feel like I was pushing with my mind or anything. It felt more like I was, like, passing through a door. Something, um, opening. Do you think you could do it again? <sighs> okay. Go for it. Okay. I'm not sure what to do. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Um, think disappear your thoughts? Really? <clears throat> okay, how about this? Do you remember what you were thinking about when it happened? Yeah, systems, modeling forces, interactions. We were talking about filtering algorithms and I was starting to see a way through the problem and then it clicked. A way to visualize it. Whoa. Are you okay? with here. I mean, is this from work, our work? I don't know. Let's try something else. Uh... Okay. <laughs> that was fun. How about...
Okay, just stop. Stop for a second. Just one more. No, 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 no. That's a living thing. Please. It's, it's okay. You can see inside it. Okay, Ben, this is really scary. We need to talk to somebody at the lab. Who? Hello? You shouldn't have gotten anywhere near this far. Who is this? Doesn't matter now. Stay there. Ben? We gotta get out of here. Through the back, they'll be there too. No, but I mean out. Put the cards out, out. Mads, I'm not sure where we'll end up. We're not a drinking glass. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to take that chance. Hey guys, I'm Sophie Thatcher. Thanks for watching Dust, and if you like this video, make sure to check out my new film, Prospect, in theaters now.